Vigilant Christian Mario, and you're here for another edition of Illuminati Media Expos. In today's video, I wanted to talk about Kesha filing a lawsuit against longtime producer, and she's claiming he abused her and drugged her up. The reason that I wanted to talk about this in my Illuminati Media Expo series is because I've been showing that there is an MK Ultra mind control program that is being used in the entertainment industry on the pop stars like Kesha, Britney Spears, and others. Now, this just shows us more proof that this is going on in the entertainment sick and twisted industry. What is MK Ultra? For those of you who don't know, I'm going to leave a lot of videos in the description section. You got a lot of catching up to do because the mainstream media is not going to tell you about this stuff and even some YouTubers are paid so that they lead you astray on this very issue. You need to check the videos out in the description section. The first one is uh, Roseanne Barr, a Hollywood insider, came out publicly and said that MK Ultra mind control rules in Hollywood. So that's kind of crazy to be saying that. MK Ultra, what is that? That's a declassified government program. The CIA, the government, was trying to figure out how they could create a totally undetectable, mind-controlled slave. I've done a video on this with uh, researcher Fritz Springmeier. We did an interview on this very subject, so I'll leave that linked up in the description section. MK Ultra Mind Control is a program where an individual is administered drugs and trauma and therefore breaks the individual down so that they can compartmentalize personalities and things in the individual. It's a very complicated scientific process, so you definitely need to check out my interview with Fritz Springmeier to figure it out. But there's drug administration, uh, drugs that are administered to the individual just like we just seen Kesha saying and there is abuse so as you can see here this would be the producer and this would be Kesha the producer would be drugging her up putting her under this type of mind control so that she can fulfill the agenda that the entertainment industry puppet masters want her to fulfill also in the description section I'm just gonna blow this out of the water Illuminati MK Ultra Hollywood exposed if you really think MK Ultra doesn't rule in Hollywood you're blind and even if you're a media analyst and you can't see this you're a paid agent now here's the thing all over Hollywood we're seeing a massive signs like Roseanne Barr said of MK Ultra mind control we had Britney Spears we have Shia LaBeouf who's having mental breakdowns Amanda Bynes they are not going crazy I'm going to leave a link in the description section to a video from Dave Chappelle who is talking about the fact that there is a sinister evil thing going on in the entertainment industry. If you don't remember, he went off to Africa. He didn't take the $50 million Illuminati deal and get an address, so he left. And he said that the entertainment industry is a sick and twisted environment. Check that out in the description section and check this video out. It just shows you more proof. Also in the description section, Shia LaBeouf, Illuminati, MK Ultra, Mind Control, Breakdown, Exposed. He, he was going around chasing homeless people, wearing a bag over his head. And of course, the mainstream media and paid agents want you to believe that he is having a mental breakdown, that there really isn't an Illuminati mind control program operating in Hollywood. That is not the truth. Do not believe those, uh, those media outlets and those false truthers. Now, in the description section as well, I'm going to put Amanda Bynes goes crazy and shoplifts or an MK Ultra mind control breakdown. Twilight, Illuminati, Mind Control, Exposed, and Britney Spears. You remember when she went crazy? No, she was just breaking free from the Illuminati cult that administers this type of mind control to her. Another video in the description section, Will I Am, Britney Spears, Scream and Shout. This is MK Ultra Illuminati symbolism right in front of your eyes about this very subject. So, MK Ultra does rule in Hollywood, and now we just have more proof. Kesha is suing because of abuse and being given drugs and things like this. Now, we need to be extremely vigilant when we analyze this. The Illuminati knows this information is going to start coming out, especially on YouTube. So because they knew that, they made sure they had someone in place. Check out my playlist, Mark Dice Exposed. Go check his channel. Look at him try and cover this stuff up. Amanda Bynes and Kesha's MK Ultra. he's trying to cover it up. He's trying to say it doesn't exist. I've exposed this guy, and I'm going to continue doing so because he is a poison within the movement. So many of you foolishly believe he is actually legit 
shit. He's brainwashed you all to think that he's here to separate the facts from the fiction when in reality he is here to control the information and gatekeep you away from the very things that the Illuminati don't want you to know about like mk ultra in the um, music industry as well as illuminati blood sacrifices this guy is constantly covering that stuff up do not be fooled they knew that i would be people like me would be coming out publicly so they had to put someone there to call people like me crazy because according to mark dice i'm crazy for thinking like roseanne barr that mk ultra rules in hollywood like fritz bringmeyer said it's a real program we're seeing the signs all over it's just blatantly obvious what's going on in the entertainment industry but the illuminati wants you to be brainwashed so they're good at what they do this is the vigilant christian saying god bless each and every one of you and as always stay vigilant